Salicornia is a genus of succulent, holophyte flowering plants in the family Amaranthaceae that grow in salt marshes, on beaches, and among mangroves. Salicornia species are native to North America, Europe, South Africa, and South Asia. Common names for the genus include glasswort, pickleweed, and marsh samphire. These common names are also used for some species not in Salicornia. The main European species is often eaten, called marsh samphire in Britain, and the main North American species is occasionally sold in grocery stores or appears on restaurant menus, usually as sea beans or samphire greens. Botanical, the Salicornia species are small, usually less than 30 cm tall, succulent herbs with a jointed horizontal main stem and erect lateral branches. The leaves are small and scale-like, and as such, the plant may appear leafless. Many species are green, but their foliage turns red in autumn. The hermaphrodite flowers are wind-pollinated, and the fruit is small and succulent and contains a single seed. Salicornia species can generally tolerate immersion in salt water. They use the C4 carbon fixation pathway to take in carbon dioxide from the surrounding atmosphere. Salicornia species are used as food plants by the larvae of some Lepidoptera species, including the Coleophracase bearers C. atroplicis and C. salicorna. Species Nearly 60 species have been proposed for Salicornia. Some common species are American, Virginia or Woody glasswort, Salicornia virginica, common glasswort, Salicornia europalia, dwarf glasswort, Salicornia bigalovia. Perennial glasswort, Salicornia perennis, purple glasswort, Salicornia ramosissima, slender glasswort, Salicornia maritima, Amari kiri, Salicornia brachiata. Culinary, Salicornia europalia is edible either cooked or raw. In England, it is one of several plants known as samphire. The term samphire is believed to be a corruption of the French name, Herbe de Saint Pierre, which means Saint Peter's herb. Samphire is usually cooked either steamed or microwaved, and then coated in butter or olive oil. Due to its high salt content, it must be cooked without any salt added, in plenty of water. It has a hard, stringy core, and after cooking, the edible flesh is pulled off from the core. This flesh, after cooking, resembles seaweed in color, and the flavor and texture are like young spinach stems or asparagus. Samphire is often used as a suitably maritime accompaniment to fish or seafood. In addition to S. europaea, the seeds of S. bigalovia yield an edible oil. S. bigalovia's edibility is compromised somewhat because it contains saponins, which are toxic under certain conditions. Amari kira is cooked and eaten or pickled. It is also used as fodder for cattle, sheep and goats. In Kalpatia, Sri Lanka, it is used to feed donkeys. On the east coast of Canada, the plant is known as samphire greens, and is a local delicacy. In southeast Alaska, it is known as beech asparagus. In Nova Scotia, Canada, they are known as crow's foot greens. In the United States, they are known as sea beans, when used for culinary purposes. Other names include sea asparagus, sea green bean, pousse pierre, passe pierre, pousse pied, sea pickle, and marsh samphire. In India, researchers at the Central Salt and Marine Chemicals Research Institute developed a process to yield culinary salt from Salicornia brocata. The resulting product is known as vegetable salt and sold under the brand Same Salini. Industrial use. Equals historical equals. The ashes of glasswort and saltwort plants and of kelp were long used as a source of soda ash for glass making and soap making. The introduction of the Leblanc process for industrial production of soda ash superseded the use of plant sources in the first half of the 19th century. Amari Kira is used as raw material in paper and board factories. Equals contemporary equals. Because Salicornia bigalovia can be grown using salt water and its seeds contain high levels of unsaturated oil and protein, it can be used to produce animal feedstuff and as a biofuel feedstock on coastal land where conventional crops cannot be grown. Adding nitrogen-based fertilizer to the seawater appears to increase the rate of growth and the eventual height of the plant, 
and the effluent from marine aquaculture is a suggested use for this purpose. Experimental fields of salicornia have been planted in Ras al Zab, Eritrea and Sonora aimed at the production of biodiesel. The company responsible for the Sonora trials claims between 225 and 250 gallons of BQ9000 biodiesel can be produced per hectare of salicornia, and is promoting a $35 million scheme to create a 12,000-acre salicornia farm in Badakino. Environmental uses Pickle weed is used in phyto extraction, it is highly effective at removing selenium from soil, which is absorbed by the plant and then released into the atmosphere to be dispersed by prevailing winds. Pickle weed has been found to have average volatilization rates 10 to 100 times higher than other species. See also, Arid Forest Research Institute. Notes. References. BBC Gardener's Question Time where there is apparently some confusion between the glasswort and the rock samphire. BBC Good Food Channel, recipes for both marsh samphire and rock samphire. Biff Vernon discusses the common confusion between marsh samphire and rock samphire, and reproduces a poem on the subject by William Logan. Robert Friedman, Reformer Journal Small Article about Experimental Biodiesel Fields in Sonora, Mexico, lists famine foods including Amari Kirai. Seawater Foundation running a seawater farm in Eritrea with salicornia to produce oil, food and store carbon dioxide.